Wow, we're going to see a lot of this here in the final. A long, hard-fought rally. She's going to question the call here, though, Agnieszka Ravanska. And a good challenge, a very good challenge, in fact. Oh, finding the baseline and a positive start this for Dominika Sibulkova. Stouns, but was very solid yesterday. That's just too good from Ravanska. Okay. And she let it go. And it fell well and truly inside the baseline. We're just standing in the center of the court and uh, taking control there. Beautiful drop shot. Oh. Oh. Oh, saves two in a row. Getting a deep first serve. Initially a baseline double backhand battle, turning into a forehand battle that goes the way of Ravanska. Yeah. Well, it's about taking your opportunities, and Ravanska is the first to take a break point with two hands. She There goes the defensive skills again from Ravanska. Oh, she made it difficult again for the approaching Sibyl a lot better. Better construction of the time. Yeah. Having to bend her back on that occasion. She's not tall by any stretch of the imagination, Sibulkova. Agnieszka Radvanska this year is the only play he didn't execute on that occasion.
Oh, excellent serving. Ten point placement wide. That is great pace from Sibyl Korva. First ace in the final. Oh, that's an outstanding return. Break point in the final. Yet to cash in. And it stays that way. Big first serve, 101 miles. And he does just that. Wasn't smooth sailing by any stretch of the imagination. Uh, she continues to defend that one break lead. She makes no mistake, and what a delightful way to close out set number one for Agnieszka Radvanska, breaking the serve of Sibulkova for a second time. Good first serve percentage. Tidy, just the uh, six unforced errors. And it was all about taking your opportunities, and while Radvanska converted... I've seen glimpse. That's a lot better again. Controlled aggression from Sibulkova. She's going to challenge it. It certainly was a very tight call. And a good challenge. A very good challenge for Sibyl Kova. Not a happy end uh, to what was another disappointing game on the receiving end, a game where she had chances. Been here in the second set. Nice delicate touch. Read the drop shot this time. Ravanska, she was on her toes, quick to come in. Rally this time. Solid strike. Right into the corner. Good depth again from Sibulkova. A very important hold of service.
he hit the line. That was a tight call. First look, I thought it was just wide. And she's going to challenge it at the end of the day. Some uh, Lots of movement in that rally. <laughs> well, the second time we've seen that now. Squeeze it through. Pretty the needle. There's been a lot of talk this week about the drop shot of Ravanska, but it must be said, Sibulkova is using that stroke to perfection in the final beat. to reply <laughs> oh that is two outstanding drop shots right back into the waiting direction of Ravansko who makes no mistake it is another service game Combination. One two punch this time from Sibyl Korva. Oh, it's just sailed long at the baseline. Swinging volley. Another well, central play that time. Stand and deliver. That's what we need to see. And again, this time on the other side. delicate touch once again drop shots now from the Slovak and my word she's played that stroke delightfully well meeting all ends up my word that is superb defense from Ravanska some strong hitting from Sibulkova and again, that ability just to keep the ball alive.
That's an excellent return on the drop shot from uh, Ravanska. She seals the deal and the grand finale at the 2013 Bank of the West Classic will be decided in a third set. Well you have to say coming into this third set it is Sibulkova who well and truly has the momentum. Has dropped off from the number one seed. Well, this time, no problems. Right down the centre. Oh. <laughs> How did she do that? That is superb stuff from Ravanska. Finding the baseline. She was well and truly on the back foot. Oh, Let's uh, have a look at these statistics. And well, first of all, that first serve percentage, 63% for Sibulkova. That was compared to just a 38%. Far and away. Hard work from both girls. Let alone win the point. Desperation and desperation pays off for Sibulkova, saving the yes. break point. Well, I certainly would have wanted to put that one away. A little bit more comfortable, I feel, there's so the uh, Slovak side. Making no mistake on that occasion. Loosening up the uh, tension on the strings there. Well, this time she makes no mistake. Wow. Here. The heart of Silicon Valley since 1997.
just going wide off the volley. If you cannot believe it there, Sivulkova. Well, she hands it over on a platter. Disappointing. Didn't panic this time, Sibulkova. Oh, oh, did well to get in. Couldn't get the lift though. Sibulkova, it is a back-to-back -back brace here in the third set. Action of Clancy once again. construction of the points at this time from Bravanska. <laughs> ah, what a reply that was uh, from Sivulkova. Keeping it tight across the net. Some nice delicate touches here this afternoon. Couldn't quite control it there. She raced back to the... Yeah, uh, for a second time in this third set, a double fault. Yeah, Hands over again. Advanska to serve. A strong return. There was nothing on that second serve from Rovansk. And a 
again. Stand and deliver. Four breaks of service in a row here in this third set. Oh. Just making it look far too easy that time. to go on that tight angle. All she found was the top of the net though there, Sybil Corbett. open space once again. Right down the line. Straight as an arrow that time. Yeah. She has now broken Ravanska on three consecutive occasions. She is was loose. Well, it sailed just long at the baseline. Goes long. Good fighting on the receiving end from Radvanska. that time.
on a championship point. Ravaska has uh, pulled out something special. A brilliant touch on the volley. And we stay alive. Gonna miss that. She finds the winner, and Dominika Sivorkova is the 2013 Bank of the West Classic Champion after a three-set thriller, two and a half hours after dropping the opening set, after being down a break on two occasions in the third. Somehow, this young 24-year-old has dug deep, playing in her eighth final, and has claimed title number three to go with the title she won in Moscow in 2011 and the title she won in Carlsbad last year what a performance from Dominika Sivorkova recording her first ever victory over Agnieszka Ravanska she lifted her service game and that was a massive part of the turnaround for Dominika Sivorkova hitting just 38 percent of her first serves in that first set and to get it up to 57 by the end. I'd like to ask your finalists to join us. Uh, one of the loveliest young ladies I've ever had the privilege to introduce to you. Please welcome your finalist, Agnieszka Rodvinska. <laughs> Aggie, I'm going to just ask you a couple of quick questions, if I can say. Uh, not the result you wanted, but uh, you have to be pleased with the fact that you made it to the finals at such an incredible event. Yes, uh, of course, my first final here, so I was um, still very happy um, about the result. Um, I mean, I was struggling with a couple of things here, with conditions, balls, courts, so it's still good that I made the final here. And you have some people here, I'm sure, joining you that uh, you'd like to say a little something to? Of course. Um, thank you, my team there, Tomek and Krzysztof, and also a couple of um, but I work at home as well, so thank you so much. Okay, congratulations. Mara, if you can help present, and Kim, the beautiful trophy, the finalist trophy of the 2013 Bank of the West Classic is now being presented to Agnieszka officially. And there you have everyone. Let's hear it once again for Agnieszka Radwańska, your finalist. Aga, if I can, can she come on over here. And now... This is pretty cool. This young lady has had an incredible successful week. I'd like to ask our 2013 Bank of the West Classic champion and the current leader in the Emirates Airline U.S. Open Series standards, please, ladies and gentlemen, welcome Dominika Sibylkova. Let's hear it for her. <laughs> Dominika, first, you know, the security guards almost tackled your dad. Luckily, he looks a little bit like you, so they knew who he was. How excited are you? Like you can see you have to, who I am so emotional, you know, <laughs> and um, he, uh, what was the question? I was talking about the crazy, the crazy fan who came down and ran on the court who looks like you. Yeah, that's what I said. It was my dad. <laughs> how excited. You've been talking about how all week long, how excited to be in Palo Alto. You love the friends, the fans, the food, University Avenue. How excited are you right now? You know, I just, uh, I don't know how to explain it. I'm just really really happy and this last game was the you know some test for me because it was really hard against Zaga and and I had to do every point by myself and even even the match point was really hard to do but um, I started to get a little bit tired but you know I, I I get through and and this is my prize you know and congratulations and I know that there are a few people that you probably like to say a little something to and then we're gonna get that beautiful trophy and that big beautiful bear handed over to you of course you know but uh, first yeah, I would like to thank to Bank of the West you know for making such a great uh, uh, 
uh, sponsoring event, and also to all people who are working for the tournament, the tournament director, Tony, and, and everybody, you know, you people here are doing a great job, and I always love coming back here. And also my team, you know, they are doing a great job. They are here with me, you know, <laughs> supporting in bed and in good times, and that's important. Congratulations on your third career title on the WTA. Kim Hall, Mara, if you can help us present this beautiful trophy to your 2013 champion, everybody. Let's hear it for Dominika Sibokova. There you go. Look at that. She's going to hold it up. Don't drop it. And while we're getting some photographs of Dominika, your champion, everyone, first of all, please remember, stick around for doubles. We have a final coming up in just a few minutes.